Hi everyone and welcome back again. In this video I am going to explain a very important subject in both Excel and Word which is male marriage. As I said male marriage is important or related with both uh, Microsoft Word and Microsoft Excel. So in order to working with the, with the subject working with male marriage or use male marriage you need to, to understand both Word and uh, Excel. So first of all why we need to use male marriage? Male marriage, you can just imagine we have something like this. For example, we have a letter. I have a letter I created in Word. So for example, I need to send this message or this letter or this equations or report or anything to multiple recipients, which means what? The same body here, the same message, but to multiple recipients. I need, for example, I, I, I have to, to, to sign this message to the 100 of employees or 100 uh, of students or maybe 1000 of employees. So here I need to change just the name. For example, the first one, Ahmad Ali, named Ahmad Ali. His name is Ahmad Ali. The second one is Mariam. The third one is Khalid and so on and so forth. And the different email for each employee or for each student, we have a different email. And here the different phone. So I need to send this message, but to multiple recipients. So in order to do that by just word, it is very difficult. So you need to add, for example, for 100 employees, I need to send this message for 100 to 100 employees. So I need to create 100 copy of this message, right? Each one with a different name. I mean, what? I can just copy this one and then just return to create another copy of this message here in another word file. And here I have to change the name. For example, here Osama. For example, and here I need to change the email as well. Here to change the mobile number. Then copy it again and paste it in another page or to create another word file. Copy, paste again. And then here I need to add another name. For example, to Omar. Here I have to change the name. In the email as well as the phone number so you can change it so it's very difficult to do that so in order to solve this problem I can just return back I have just one message here so here I just create one message and I can merge this message with the like a database in the Excel file so now I have this message or this letter here in the word file and I have a list of names and emails in the Excel file. So here in the Excel file, I have a list of emails and names. So the first, I need the first message, send it just to, to Ali Muhammad, for example, with this email and with this particular phone. The second message will be to this one and so on. So now I have a list here of names in Excel and I have a letter here in Word. So now here we have this letter, for example, or this message. So I need to send this message to multiple recipients, right? So just go here to the mailing in the word. And then here you can start mail marriage. So you can select, I need the letter or email or what. So now I need just letters, for example, to write a letter. So it is not important. Now here, select recipients from where? I need to add a list. I, I, I have already explained that we have this one right here. We have an Excel file. So I need the recipients to, to add the names and the emails and phone for recipients from this Excel file, right? It is like a resource or the, like a database for our file. So here I need to add select. You can type a new list by yourself from here. You can add any name and type any information you want. Or you can use uh, one use existing list. So we have already a list, right? Use an existing list. So select it from here. And you have just to find it because I added here email marriage. So we have this list, right? So just select this list. We need uh, which uh, sheet here? We have many, maybe we have more than one sheet in the workbook Excel. So we have just one sheet here. If you just select that, we have just one sheet called sheet one, right? So here just select, you have just sheet one. We need just sheet one, sheet one, and okay. Now I add the resource. So now I make like a marriage between Excel file and the Word file. So this. Excel file now, the list of names and emails and uh, phone numbers now already here in the Word file. So now, first thing I need what? Here, there, Ahmed Ali. I, I don't need this one because this tool changing. The first message will be Ahmed Ali, the second message will be 
Omar and so on, right? So maybe I, I have 100 recipients or employees or students, for example. Uh, so I can delete that now. I need to add another thing instead of it. Greeting line. This here is like a greeting line, right? There or two. So you can go here, greeting line, and add. So I need there, for example, or two, for example, two. To who? Just add a name. For example, just add Mr. or Miss or something, or just add a name. So I just add name here, for example, first name and second name. Here you can add this one here, greeting to someone. This one should be from Excel file, and then add this one. So here, a greeting line for invalid recipient. For example, if the recipient uh, is uh, in the, the, the row in the Excel file is empty, nothing inside it. So here just you can add dear sir or madam because there is no name. If there is a problem or mistake or error in Excel file, so you can just add there, replace it by dear sir, sir, uh, dear, sir or madam. Because I don't know, there is no name, for example. Here, match field. So now I need to match the field here in Word with the field in the Excel file. So the first thing I need, first name, right? Here two, and the name. So the name from where? So just add the name from the name. The name from the name in the Excel file. In the Excel file, we have name, email, and phone, right? Here, we have just name, email, and phone. So I need the name from the name. And the last name I don't need because not much. Why? Because here, you can see, we have just one name. Not, we have, not uh, like, uh, first name, last name, and so on. Just in the one field, one cell, we have the first name and last name. So here just I need first name with the first name and just okay, too much. Now you can see here like a preview. For the first one will be to Ali Muhammad Abdullah, which is here, right? Ali Muhammad Abdullah. The second one, if you just make a preview, will be Khalil Jassim and so on, so forth, just uh, to see a review. So I just here like this and okay. Now I add like a greeting line. I can make a preview here just to see. So just make a preview and you can see now the first one or the here we have number six. He was Sabr Khalid. Again, we have Ibrahim Jamil and we have Musa and so on from Excel file. Now here you can just deselect the preview. Now email, of course the email is changing. So I need to change that as well. So here I can just uh, delete that and instead add it from here. Here, not a greeting line, but insert marriage field. So I need to insert the marriage field from where? From name or email or phone in the Excel file. Of course, from email, right? So just write email here because we have email. So I need the email here. So now if I make like a preview, you can see the email will be like this. The second one will be like this and so on. So the email, I get the email from here as well. You can deselect that. Here, for example, you can write if you want, for example, you can write email and make it like this. And again, just make a preview. It will be like this. So as you want, you can write anything. But the, the most important thing is I, is I need the email from the file, from the Excel file. Deselect that again. Here, please send me a report. It is just fix it, right? I don't need to change in this. It is not changing. The same, I need to send all employees, for example, or or recipient with this email or this message. So it's not important. I don't need to change. Thanks, I don't need as well. So here, phone number, of course, I need the phone number from Excel file. So I need to delete that as well and then just insert field and just phone. It's very easy. So now the phone will be from here. So if you just make a preview, now you can see here to run a and with this email and with this phone number. I select that again to Ali Muhammad and with this phone number and with this different email. And so on, you can see it's changing like this here. So now everything, I complete everything. If you have other cells, for example, here, you can add other cells and you can change the content of the message. So now I explain that in cell marriage, a greeting line, Address block, sometimes if you have address, so you can add address block from here, for example. I don't have an address now, but if you have, just address block here. So address will be like this, for example, insert anything and just OK. Here, I, I mean, the recipient's name will be like this, for example. Insert postal address or format, so just OK here. Here, just add Hewa because there is no address in the Excel file, just the name. So just add Hewa, for example, add the name. 
Uh, this uh, edit uh, recipient list you can edit that if you want for example for example I need everything except uh, Khalil so Khalil I can just deselect Khalil from here and okay I can sort from A to Z for example sorted by name for example ascending or descending so I can make it ascending for example and okay now you can make it like this you can add the filters if you want here some filters here for example you can add this filter when the name equals something or when the num phone for example equals something you can add a filter if you want but now I don't need uh, any filter here I need all names here except uh, just accept Khalil Jassim for example you can do many things uh, find duplicates uh, you can uh, find recipients if you want now just ok now you can see if you just make a review now I have all names except Khalil because I delete Khalil for example everything the names will change here for example there is nothing for example here if you just go here I have like a table but there is no recipients here so instead of that just add there sir or madam because there is no name in the excel file so just like this I complete that now uh, now just uh, finish marriage so I need to do what here edit individual documents to create like a here for example we have 100 uh, recipients so it will create 100 letters or for example just to print it or send it by email directly by the email for all those recipients depending on the emails or just edit for individual or just to print for example if you just say print print all or from something to something and just ok it will be print all those messages or just you can say edit individual document and all ok now you can see create multiple document the first one there sir or madame because there is nobody here same thing same thing but where is the name you can see to Ali Muhammad and different email different pass here you can add all the names you can see create the messages for all the names with the different information just depending on this excel file we have just 27 so now just to create 27 pages here in this letter so this is the most important information about uh, mail merging I hope you understand that and thank you very much.